inventors have initial questions about what type of intellectual property they need, and many are confused with the difference between a patent, a trademark, and a copyright. A lot of times they'll see the price tag for a trademark being very, very cheap compared to the patent application, and they'll think, well, I really want a trademark. Yeah, you may want a trademark, you probably should consider a patent application if you have an invention that is worth protecting. Patents will protect the way something works or the way something looks. A trademark will protect a brand identity, but it will just protect a brand identity. It won't protect the function of an item. It won't protect the function of your invention or the way your invention works. It will just protect your identity, your brand name, your company name, or something like that that's closely associated with your product. So you need a trademark, you probably also need a patent as well if you have an invention that's going to be sold. I've been an attorney for about 15 years. I've been practicing intellectual property exclusively for about a decade now. I love IP. Uh, it's really interesting. I get to work with all sorts of inventors with creative ideas. By and large, I'm dealing with people at a positive time in their lives as opposed to a lot of other lawyers who get to deal with them when they're going through a divorce or having an argument with somebody over something that's resulted in litigation. So I feel very fortunate to be practicing in the field in which I practice. I also get to travel to visit my clients in a lot of very cool places, like Hong Kong here. And uh, Hong Kong is my favorite city in the world. I just love my time here. It's a beautiful place to visit. If you ever have a chance, I urge you to come here. It has the best trade shows in the world, uh, some of the finest food, the, probably the cheapest ferry system around that will take you across Hong Kong Bay. And it's uh, genuinely a nice place to spend a week or so.